With your severe weather overview on this Monday, I'm meteorologist Gretchen Mishik. First off, we're taking a look at some of the severe storms from yesterday, where those storms are headed today, mainly along the Gulf Coast, plus more April rain and abundance of it means flooding for some locations. So first off, the storm reports from yesterday do include several reports of tornadoes. These include uh, system that moved through yesterday and early this morning. Also several wind and hail damage reports and some of those hail reports were incredibly large out of Duster, Texas, four and a half inches. That is softball size hail. So obviously a hailstone of that magnitude does a tremendous amount of damage and uh, several areas reporting very large hail. Well, now today, those storm systems are shifting eastward, and the zone of concern does include some major metropolitan areas. So we do have an enhanced risk zone, and New Orleans is included in that. We've had some strong storms already this morning, and those are going to continue to shift eastward. That slight risk extends northward to include the Dallas area, thunderstorms possible all across the southeast today from Texas all the way down into the southeastern corner of Florida, but especially here along the Gulf Coast in the southern portions of Louisiana. That's what we'll be watching for. So forecast here as we head into the afternoon shows these storms uh, becoming uh, stronger in intensity as the day goes on. And we'll be watching especially along the southern portions of Mississippi and into the southern portions of Louisiana. By tomorrow, that storm threat continues to shift eastward to include the panhandle of Florida. Mobile will also be within that slight risk zone and then continuing to shift further eastward into the day on Wednesday. So uh, those storms may be diminishing a bit in intensity by the time we get to Wednesday, but we'll continue to keep an eye on it. Check back here for more severe weather updates.